Come in and have a seat. How do you want me to talk to you here? You want me to say Jonah or Nick? You can just call me Nick for short. I'm gonna do my intro, I'm gonna walk out of the closet. You could just be chilling. Okay. All right, let's get this over with. <sighs> man, I just don't care about this episode, you know? I had Josh Peck here last week. Now I got this YouTuber, Jonah Hill lookalike. I'm an actor too. I'm not just a YouTuber, I act. You're a YouTuber, bro. I was in a Volvo commercial two weeks ago. What did you play in the car? <laughs> <laughs> the car. Wanna be Jonah Hill. No, it's not, you don't, don't intro it like that. I'm not a wannabe Jonah Hill. Well, look alike. I don't even want to be called Jonah in the Actor, first place. comedian, YouTube star, Nick Antonian. Thanks for coming in. Yeah, thank you for having me. I've been wanting to do this for a long time. Okay. Pull up a picture of a haircut you want. Have you seen this? Look at that. You believe that shit? What's up with that, Ellen? You think it's cool to steal ideas? What? She probably came up with it first. No, she did this last Ellen. week. What do you want? I want to look like Ryan got him, Ryan Gosling. Okay. All right, yeah, we can do that. Don't bald me, because I'm still on, I have to do reshoots. I'm not gonna, dude, come on. He's gonna f***ing shave it right off, mother f I know it. No, I'm not. I give good haircuts. I want people to come on this show. You think if I, if I just f*** people's hairs up, then more celebrities are gonna want to come on? That would never work out. First time I filmed somebody that I've already given a haircut to once before. What's your whole show about? It's just like a, a haircut show where we show the transformation of the haircut and we do some like little jokes and goofs in between. Is it comedy? Yeah, you're in comedy, right? Some, I mean, a little, I don't know. I seen your show, Road to Comedy, loved it. Thank some you. of my favorite stuff on YouTube. Thank you. So we do some little goofs once in a while. I got a special guest tonight. He's our roast master, Jason Nash. Thanks guys, how's it going? Good to be here. This is a lot of fun. This is a lot of fun. Hey, Jonah, how are you doing? I'm doing all right. Thank Great. you. Great. Your haircut looks awesome. Jonah is working on his stand-up comedy. Right now, he's uh, just trying to stand up, actually. I, I don't like making fun of Jonah at all, but everybody fucking loves it so much. David wants to open a kebab shop with Jonah, but he's afraid Jonah will eat all the profits. Jonah's penis is so small, the Hubble telescope can't see it. <laughs> Jonah likes to brag about how good he is in bed. Turns out he means good at eating cheeseburgers. <laughs> Jonah once jumped a motorbike into my pool, and the people that were hurt the most were the 50 killed by the tidal wave. Okay, that's my time, everybody. Uh, see you down at the next show, the next Jeff. Thanks for having me. Jonah That was Thank great, you. Jason. Thank you. I loved it. Those are some of the best jokes I ever heard. Can we get a shot of you just like laughing so you don't look mad the whole time? Yeah. Can we just do like some, try out some different laughs? Uh huh. Just like, okay, one that's really. I got you. I got like, you. I'll make one that one looks, a little, makes you look good. A little funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Now one that's like one that killed. <laughs> I hear you could last about five to six hours. That's, that's right. Why don't you tell us a little about that? Well, I'm one of the most long-lasting people I know. And you've never worn a condom once. You said to me before the show, right? No, I have all the time. <laughs> I go like this usually, like let's say this is the girl. I'll go some like. I'll go. I'll like kind of softly go into it. Nice, like all right. All right, everybody. It's time for our next segment. Guess the food. We're gonna give you foods while you're blindfolded and you're gonna have to guess the origin of the food. Do you mind just signing this? What is this? This is a talent release. We just get everybody to sign it. All right. Thank you. What is this? Grandma's peanut butter. What is this? Just, let me smell it. Okay, you can smell it. It's a corn tortilla taco shell. Jesus. Wow, that's fucking <laughs> good, man. So what's next for you, man? You gotta see what this guy does with a frying pan. Yeah, I know, it's, it's real. It's really shit. Hey, Joe, since you're here, do you mind just opening this jar of pickles for me oh, quick? Yeah. Whoa! Anybody want a pickle? Ooh, yummy. Do I look like Ryan Gosling? You look bit? exactly like Ryan Gosling. Do you think so? Yeah, yeah. Thank you're you. just sweating a little bit. Yeah, I mean, no <laughs> shit. I ran away from a killer man with a chainsaw. Oh, yeah. 
So what's your biggest regret in your life? Biggest regret in my life? Sitting on this barber chair. In your entire life? Yeah, in my entire life. Huh. You're going to retire soon? From so cutting hair? Yeah, I guess. Oh, I've been retired. Yeah? I haven't cut hair in years. You cut my hair. Are you saying just on YouTube or are you trying to go somewhere else? I'm just waiting for Marvel to come pick me up. After you're finished, you kind of gave me a little pecker with the... Well, yeah. Razor. Are you uh, mad about something? It was, a, it, was, it was a backhanded question. Do you see me in a Marvel movie? Or, do, fuck. Do you see me in a Marvel... God damn it. Do you see me in a Marvel, Marvel no. movie? No. <laughs> do you see me in a Marvel movie? If you can't say that line, then it's probably going to be a Are little, leave it all little in there? tough. No, we edit all this. Say it again. Do you see me in a Marvel movie? Yeah, of course, dude. Yeah? I would see myself mostly as Spider-Man or something like that. I could see you playing Spider-Man. And I know I sound very sarcastic when I say things, but I truly believe in you and you know that. Off camera, don't even put this in. Off camera, I've always loved your stuff and that's why I had you come on the show. I got people lining up, musically f boys for days, but I had all this stuff for you. Thank you. Because one day when you're huge... What kind of huge do you mean? Because um, I've been trying to lose some weight lately. Would you be down for me to be your personal trainer? I might need something like that. Between us, I've used your picture on Tinder before. Have you? Yeah, I have. Are you serious? Yeah. You're not kidding. You've actually used my photo? I've used your photos on Tinder. So what do you do when the girl shows up? I just apologize. And does it, does it work? Sometimes. Yeah? Yeah. Well, keep at it. I'm looking good, dude. Pick up your chin like this. You have kind of the same shaped head as Gosling. Yeah. It's kind of like a styrofoam peanut, you know, when you open the, up a package, <laughs> you know? Yeah, and no, I, I get that a lot, dude. I actually get Ryan Gosling more than I get Nick. I believe and then it. And I'll be like, no, I'm Nick. You date any lucky girls? Uh, no. Uh, lazy, they're kind of getting crazy over you. Why do you say that? Huh? Why do you say that? I don't know, you're kind of like the new hotshot around town. Who's the old hotshot in town? Yeah, it used to be me. Oh yeah? Yeah. Who was the old hotshot before that? It was Todd. Oh. Uh. You threw him under the bus completely. I threw Todd under the bus? I mean, a little bit. Now you kind of came in and you know you took his old character of being the hot guy. People don't even want to look at Todd, actually. How do you feel about taking your best friend's job? Todd used to be a barber? No, Todd was, uh, he was a YouTube sensation. How did Vardon like his haircut last time? He hated it. What is that stuff? Just a little pomade. Are you going to continue keeping up with this style if uh, I'm not there to do your hair every day? Yeah. Can I come to you, I mean, sometimes just to get it freshened out? You come three, four times a week, but I can't guarantee that I'll be available to do your hair every morning. Okay. I got a couple things going on. Okay. Um, you're, you're probably living, and you're living the life, dude. Well, you're about to be living it too, because you look identical to Ryan Gosling. I think a girl would give you a number? I'll give you. Thank you, Joe, I appreciate it. All right, so you ready for the big reveal? Yeah, I'm ready. All right, you're good, you're good, Joe. Jeff, with Jim. The, with the product? What the fuck name is. Are you going out tonight? No, just gonna go home. So you're just gonna go to bed with all this product in your hair? <laughs> yeah, I mean, hopefully I get a girl's number in my dream. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. What do you think? I f myself. Yeah, I would too. Uh, you f me? No, uh, no, myself. I'm sorry. Do you actually like it? Yeah, I like it a lot. You know, when I was pulling up into the parking lot, getting ready to get my hair cut, I was a bit hesitant. You almost canceled on me. I did. Why did you do that? Did you actually have plans or did you just not want to get the hair cut? No, I didn't have plans. You made that up? Yeah, I did. Well, I'm glad you changed your mind. I had a great time with you here today. You're one of the funniest guys in the crew. And Thank you. it was an honor to have you on the show. I appreciate it. I don't get that too often. Well, you deserve a lot more compliments. And you're about to get them. So go out there and get those compliments. Thank you. Look sexy for the camera.